How much is your windbreaker? Five pounds. How much, sorry? Five. Five. Yeah. All right, I'll let it wander around. I might come back. Yeah, Thank you. Good. Cheers. How much is your wallpaper? 50p each. Cool. There we go, got six rolls there. Thank you. That's three pound. Thanks so much. Cheers. Bye bye now. Hiya, you all right? Yeah. How much are your uh, jackets? Depends on which one. The North and the Polo? They're both 15 each. 15 each, okay. They are in. Yeah, they're good. Nah, it's going to be too small for me, but... Could you do 25 for the pair? You couldn't do any cheaper, it's no. got to be 15 each. I just said 15 each because you're looking at two. No, that's fine. Go on, we'll give it a go. Yeah. Yeah, why not? I'll give it a hangers back though. Thank you. Thank you. They are in good condition, so yeah, it makes are. all the difference. How much is your woody? How much are your um, leapfrog stuff as well? Um, if you want the whole box for fiver. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, it does work, but it's just such a mess. Yeah, no, of course. Uh, he's two pounds. Two pounds, okay. He has no hat and that doesn't work. Yeah, sure. He did make a noise. Yeah, we're looking for one with the noise and stuff. I'll have a look at your finger pad stuff anyway. Uh, sorry, leap pad. Big bag goes on the telly. 
Oh yeah, it connects up. Yeah, I'll grab that. Do you want the crate back? Yeah, that's fine. I'll put it all in the trolley and I'll give it back to you. There was a book one as well, but it's a pink thing. Oh yeah. Perfect. How much your dry fit tops out of interest? Four pounds. Four pounds, okay. Alright, thank you mate. Have a little wander around. Cheers. How much is your camera? 25. 25. Yep. All right, I'll need that one. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Cheers. Sorry, mate, how much is your ink? Um, well, it's kind of all going together. Oh, you're not selling it separately? No. Oh, okay. How much is it all together out of interest? Um, three quid. Three quid. Can I pay three quid for the ink and leave the other bits for someone else to take? I just don't need to take the print. No, no, you I just, I just you want to get rid of it? As a lump, really. All right. <laughs> oh, I have a little thing. So you want to take the printer oh, with me? Oh, <laughs> Might be back. No, no. I, I believe it works. Should we want to lug the printer? <laughs> I might pop back in a sec. Oh, have I a think. Oh. Cheers. How much are your Furbies out of interest? The Connect ones are £10. Okay. Um, these ones are £8. Yeah. And then the little ones, £4. Okay, cool. And they match the... Yeah, they all match up together, don't they? Lovely, thank you. Would you consider a deal on all the Furbies at all? Um, if I took the whole lot from you, what kind of price would you think of for the lot? Um, this is what I'm looking for. 40 for all of them. 40. Which is a bargain when yeah. they're 55 each. They're not cheap, no, yeah, I know. And they do all work. I mean, this one's still got batches in it. Yeah, I've heard one of them talking. Yeah. Let's see how much money I've got left. Oh, you can do it. <laughs> no, I can hear him now. You've set him off. You put that on, don't you? Shut him up. <laughs> oh, we had one and I sold it in a week. I don't know, they didn't love them at the time, but. Then you think you're mad now. spending all that money on this. Yeah, yeah. Well, they're worth quite a bit now. Yeah, yeah. 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 well. 50 bucks. Have you finished? Have you finished? No, I'm still trying. Can I um, I'd like a £6 fat one, because it may have been more. I've literally got £39.50 left. What do you reckon? £39.50 for all the Furbies. What, all of them? Yeah. Yeah, they did cost a lot, but... Oh, actually, hold on, I've got another 20p, so 35, what's that, 35.70, 30, uh, 39 pounds 70. <laughs> Unless you accept 20 pounds Scottish note and then I can give you 40. Uh, don't no. wear it, sorry, I don't wear Scottish note. Yeah, that's literally yeah, no, everything. That's Are you sure? Then, okay. okay. Deal with it. <laughs> there we go, let me get the other 20p as well and then, Thanks. oh, there we are. You've got an extra uh, two pence as well, and that is me out. All right, thank, <laughs> thank you. you. I don't have a bag. No, I've got this say. IKEA bag, you're all good. I've got to listen to that the whole way home now. Yep. Amazing. <laughs> as you can see, that is me all spent out, and the Furbies are talking to me. Um, that was honestly all the money I brought out with me. Oh, true. I don't know if you can hear that, but that is literally all the money I brought out with me. And this is going on. Anyway, um, so I, the reason I didn't bring much money today to the car boot is because I'm trying to restrict myself a little bit because of the amount of stock I do have. 
I think you can just keep spending, 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 but if the money's not coming in, all the cash is going out, your cash flow is gonna quickly deteriorate. Anyway, the last deal now, I think I've done pretty well. Um, I would have flashed up comps at the end of the clip, but uh, the reason I went for this deal is I know with coming up to Christmas, Furbies um, sell really quick and i'm used to selling them although it's not clothing and there wasn't much clothing here um i feel it was a pretty good deal uh 39 pound 72 pence i think it was in the end a bit of a weird number it was really weird because although it's like 20p she was kind of thinking about it quite a bit and i did think at one point she was actually going to like change her mind and up the price especially when she was speaking to her mum. Anyway, I think I've done pretty good. Um, these ones here, the box ones, go, I've seen anywhere from 35 to 45 on them ones. Um, so them two there are gonna put me in the profit and then the rest is gonna be all gravy. So uh, yeah, pretty happy. Bit of a fail, I think, on the clothing bits. Um, still learning clothing, saw two bits of clothing really and i must admit down here in um exmouth where i am an exeter and torquay area i haven't found lots of men's clothing i don't know whether it's just the luck of the draw with the car boot sales i've gone to but i am grateful for the boot sales i normally go to because i normally pick up quite a bit so uh yeah anyway i hope you enjoyed that little one short and sweet i will see you in the next one